OK, boomer, that's fundamentally offensive. The University of Oklahoma is denouncing a professor who compared the popular ageist catchphrase to the N-word during a senior journalism class. Peter Gate, Director of Graduate Studies at the university's Gaylord College of Journalism and Mass Communication, used the racial slur during a class Tuesday while comparing it to the trendy OK, Boomer putdown, claiming the phrase was equally offensive, according to a statement released by interim president Joseph Harris Jr. While the professor's comments are protected by the First Amendment and academic freedom, his comment and word choice are fundamentally offensive and wrong, the statement read. The use of the most offensive word, by a person in a position of authority, hurt and minimized those in the classroom and beyond. Gade made the comparison during a discussion about technology and social media as it pertains to journalism, suggesting to students that reporters should focus more on traditional aspects of the profession, according to the university's newspaper, the OU Daily. That prompted a student in the class to say that journalists need to keep up with the times and younger readers. Gade then said the student's remark was akin to saying, OK, boomer, multiple students in the class told the newspaper. Calling someone a boomer is like calling someone a n-r, Gade said. At least one student told Gade during the class that he shouldn't use the racial slur in class. He then tried to defend it before changing the subject, the newspaper reports. A message seeking comment from Gade early Wednesday was not immediately returned. Some students left Gade's class immediately after the remark, according to the student newspaper. One senior majoring in broadcast journalism, one of just three black students in the class, is now questioning whether she feels comfortable returning to the course. I love Gaylord to death. Janae Reeves told the newspaper. That is my college, but I'm already one out of three black students in that class. So it was only two of us to be in that setting and to hear that, I shut down immediately after he used it. Gade's comparison was also blasted as absolutely despicable by one Oklahoma student who posted about the incident on Facebook. Several others also suggested that the university fire the longtime professor immediately. That's completely unacceptable, one woman wrote. 